morning y'all it is thursday it's like 7 26 i am on my way to my interview i brought my shirt to change in y'all know i'm not all girly and shit but um yeah here's my hair after i took my braids out if you can see yeah so let's go take like an hour hour and a half as y'all know i go to work at um 10 well, at the most, I would be like 9.30. And I wrote down all of my past jobs, which is only six of them. And one of them is closed, which is Toys R Us. They're no longer a company. Um, and yeah, so I just got my W-2 for that. So it should go fast. Got my diploma, my driver's license, my social security. And yeah, let's see how it goes. I'm excited. I feel like if I do get this job, although it gets paid less, it's still going to be like something new towards the step that I want to go in. So yeah. Here, I think I found COVID-19 testing right here. Let me show y'all. And I look and look. That sign says, please stop. I'm not sure what it is, but the only thing it could be is COVID-19 testing, right? Parked by a pig. Or a police, I mean. <laughs> I'm just playing. But this is with the new shirt. I feel like people are watching me, but obviously they're not. And so yesterday was, I told y'all, yesterday's video you'll see on Friday. So this one you'll see on Tuesday. But yesterday, I told y'all that I wanted McDonald's, and this is right by McDonald's. So I'm like, oh, maybe I can get McDonald's on my way home. Probably not. I was thinking about getting a sweet tea and getting my boyfriend a mocha, just because I'm a sweet little girl. I'm just playing. But, yeah. So, it's 7.40. I'm going to go ahead and go in because, you know, you need to arrive early. If it's not 15 minutes early, you're late. And considering I missed Tuesdays, I need to be early and put my A fucking game on, bitch. So, let's fucking do this. Y'all, I just figured out what they're doing. They're over there by the main entrance, too. And they're taking people's fucking temperatures before we go in. I'll be fine. It's going to be okay. All right, let's go. There's a little outfit of the day. And my window, well, I'm holding this knife so like official. My interview went great. It is 9.30 now. I don't think I have time to go to McDonald's. But basically, I have a new job and yeah I'm excited it's great I will um explain to y'all basically my new job what I'll be doing everything I'm gonna be working in the morgue which if you know me which you don't really but um that is my shit um uh frozen mocha frappe and I got me a sweet tea it's right here in my lap um basically i will be like a little security officer at the hospital dealing handling the more just trauma patients um securing the helo pad um and yeah just um i'll be getting my security license a d license um next week and i should in June, so right now the pay is like 12.25 which is a l not it's less than what I make now um about it's more than a dollar less but come in July I'll be getting a raise to $16 an hour because I will be a taser officer for enhanced security so that would be coming in just a couple of months so I think I could really like suck it up only make like making 12.25 for what two months and then get bumped up to 16 dollars that would be fine um there's no pay time off which 
which is fine. I mean, I can still take days off, but I just wouldn't get paid for it. Um, so I think that's fine. And what else? I really like it because I don't think I've ever really talked to y'all about it, but I'm very into like the health field. Like I want to be a forensic pathologist, which is where, um, once someone passes away, you do an autopsy and whatnot. Y'all get the point. Um, and I found out that today I would be like transporting to the morgue and like going into the morgue. Um, meeting up with the funeral home people and everything which is interesting um, and they're like yeah people who are donor organ donors um, <clears throat> the Emmy will take out like the eyeballs for cornea transplant um, in that like sometimes it's very shocking when you open up the body bag to look at a toe tag and you see they're an organ donor and there's like PVC pipe holding the structure of their limbs so it's cool as fuck I'm excited I definitely the process hiring process can take about four weeks he said especially with COVID-19 it may take longer than that which will put me right at probably mid-June so that gives me time to really think about it um, put my two weeks in and then shortly after I start <clears throat> I'll get my taser license um, and then I'll get raised to $16 an hour. So it's all going to be very fast paced, which he said the job is fast paced. I'll be moving around the hospital, dealing with psychiatric or patients um, in the psych ward. It's just going to be awesome. I'm so excited to finally have a job that I'm so excited for. I'm going to enjoy it so much. I already know, like I can already tell. It's just one of those things like that is me, like, Maybe not as far as an officer, but I'm gonna be there to like see all this crazy shit happen. And another thing that um, <clears throat> the guy who was interviewing me, I'm not gonna mention his name because I didn't tell him I had a YouTube channel. Um, another thing is that, <coughs> excuse me. Um, oh, he was like, they're bringing the tasers because of this one incident um, a couple weeks ago where so you walk into the entrance and there's a triage desk where the triage nurse nurse sits and this man walked up to her in front of her and said I'm an organ donor and shot himself and blew his brains out right in front of her so yeah she was he said that before his body that man's body even hit the floor she had the security people and everyone she could get coming to her help so yeah i'm excited so yeah and i i will be getting paid weekly which is nice um and yeah i'm about to go home and tell my boyfriend and surprise him with a drink yeah i'm excited i think he'll be happy for me i'm going to mention <laughs> so him and i dated hold up hold on hold on let me tell my you. boyfriend and i we dated when we were in high school okay and we were like 15. oh lord the police so we dated in high school and my first job was beloved taco bell and I was like, hey, they're hiring, <laughs> okay? And we had been dating for, I think, like, a couple months. And he got a job at Taco Bell. And then we broke up because I think, like, us working together was just, like, too much. Like, mm-mm. I think that's why now, like, with this whole quarantine shit, like, we're kind of arguing a lot. I think it's because we're around each other all day, every day, nonstop. I love him, though. Like, I'm... I love it, but I think we do still need our space from each other, obviously, or not for obviously, but for obvious reasons, just because we're still individuals, but <laughs> so I was so heartbroken when he broke up with me and <laughs> I told my manager, I was like, you better keep that boy away from me. I'm going to push his head in his fucking fryer. <laughs> So I don't think he would get a job with me, but I will tell him that they are hiring. It's so fun. I'm so excited. I just said it's so fun and I haven't even like started working there, but I'm fucking excited. 
I'm about to call my best friend and tell her. So I will talk to y'all later. Let me park. All right, y'all. Deuces. So I may end this video here because it's already like 10 minutes long. So I will have my own Mother's Day video of what we're doing on Mother's Day. Um, I want to show y'all my little plant experiment that I'm trying. I remember when I was in elementary school, put little seeds in a damp paper towel and like put them in the window and they should start sprouting. It's not happening, I think, because of the way our building is set. Obviously, the sun is like coming down this way, but we don't have windows on that side, so I don't think it's working. But these are jalapeno seeds and that's like the core. Hopefully they don't just mold. Because that would suck. But that was all for this video. I'm so excited about this job. Hopefully it's a new beginning and a new lesson and new experiences. And I'm so excited. I'm sure y'all will be getting many updates about it. Um, but I hope y'all enjoyed and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.